As the chorus for change grows, students in one Northeast Ohio city are setting their sights on the nation's capital. Tonight, the shocking support they weren't expecting that's now helping make their protest plans even bigger than first thought. They're taking a stand. It affects us personally, and we can't just sit by anymore. And speaking out. I've never been afraid to use my voice. A new student-led group giving Lakewood High students a platform to promote change. We are young, but we're not going to be silenced any longer. Sarah Pepe and Isabella Bryson founded the Student Committee of Activism. We just want to inspire um, other students to maybe follow in our footsteps and try and get their, their voice out there. Their first project. I want to go down there to be side by side with these kids and solidarity with them. Send a handful of classmates to the nation's capital next weekend. It's to show our legislators that we're not messing around. With a goal of $500, the group launched a GoFundMe page to cover the cost of bus tickets to D.C. Um, I did not expect the outburst of support. Teachers, community members, and businesses have stepped up in a big way. And it kind of spiraled, <laughs> and now we have our own charter bus. The financial backing. In the past six days, we've raised over $6,000. <laughs> giving about 40 young people from Northeast Ohio. That our community really wants them to be able to have a voice an opportunity to bring their battle for safer schools to the national level. That's exactly what we want for our future. Um, no matter what their opinions are, we want them to feel like they can express themselves. The community support. I've always wanted to be a part of change in the world. Giving these students hope that they can do just that. It makes my heart full, honestly, to see that like we can do something. And I was really, really concerned for a while that we weren't going to make it. Well, they did in a big way, too. For now, the Student Committee of Activism at Lakewood High School will focus on gun violence because it's at the forefront right now. But student organizers tell me they want to focus on other movements going forward.